Well, YouTubers, time to make another video. Really sorry for all my fans, 500 views, I'm so happy, but we was just so busy over the last week that I, I didn't have time to make. I'm sorry, really sorry about that. So, let's talk a little bit about that, since I missed that. Um, oh, I ever do good on my picks, but just my, for myself. Um, you know, uh, that is yeah, one week I miss. Oh, well. So, yeah, Broncos or Colts, Lions doing well, Chiefs, Eagles, what a game that was. Um, yeah, won about $150. I had to bet more because the odds were so good as I picked, of course, you know, the, the, the best teams, Jacksonville, Baltimore, Washington, Philadelphia, KC, uh, what an upset that was with the Panthers and Packers, I, I couldn't believe that game. Saints destroyed them, Bills, uh, Rams, Fortnite, pay. So, God, I'm so disappointed with the Raiders. Like, look, two huge plays, guys. Think about it. Man Rosselberger on the one yard line trying to throw, what was he thinking? Spike the ball, kick the field, get, go to overtime. He tried to force it in. People are saying that the coach showed, I, he was trying to spike it. He changed the play, I think. He either is paid off or something. It's just the, the sports world and, the, and, and betting make, trying to make money because they would have won that game. If the guy would have intercepted the ball in the beginning of the drive, it would have been intercepted the game over. Um, you guys know that. It's not rocket science. With the, remember the Jets and Eagles, always uh, something fishy going on there. Same with my team. Derek Carr on the one-yard line fumbles the ball. And Dallas wins. You know, many people are dead betting in Dallas. Now Raiders season's over. So let's get into week 16. And so no more Thursday games. So tonight I'll pick Atlanta on the Monday night game. Colts and Ravens. I guess I love the way the Ravens are playing right now. I'll pick Ravens on that one. They're hot right now. Vikings and Packers. At as because Packers lost that game against the Panther, it doesn't look good for them. I'm taking Vikings. Um, Rams and Titans is a no-brainer. Rams are just so hot right now. Um, fans, NFL fans, sports fans, where this is going to be exciting time for the wild card playoff and the divisional playoffs and even the championship games. We're going to see great playoffs. And I hope you're going to tune in, and I'm going to be so excited. There's going to be some phenomenal games coming up. Uh, Bills and Patriots, I'm going to take Bills. I hate the Patriots. Um, I'm just wearing this because I hope they can win one game. And I'm putting it out there right now. Bears and Browns. I'm taking the Browns. Let's hope that they can get one win this year. Just one. Falcons saying is going to be a shootout from the beginning to the end. I'm going to take the Falcons on this one. No, I'm sorry, the Saints, because the Falcons have a short week. They're playing tonight, and the Saints with a great win there. Um, don't really, like, I looked at the receivers of the Saints. I watched that entire game, and so did I watch the entire game of the Pittsburgh and New England. And the Saints, they don't have very good receivers. Um, Falcons do. Uh, but still, it's at home, and Saints have to keep winning. To they want to get to higher up in the standings. Lions and Bagels. I'm gonna take Lions. Like the way they're playing right now. Bucks and Panthers. Two of my favorite teams, but I'm taking Panthers. They gotta bounce back from that loss that they had. I they did one, but they still gotta keep going. Dolphins and Chiefs. I'm gonna take Chiefs on that one. Uh, Broncos are red. I'm not going to spend too much time some of these games because just again towards the end of the season, you know how a lot of teams are going to be pulling their players and the red and rest. Um, so for those of you betting, be careful out there because remember, you know, check the lineups, check check the rosters, make sure that your favorite players. You know, I this happened to me so many years where I would think, oh, okay, well it's easy to win, like. I knew like this weekend, last weekend for sure, and I was happy on my bets. But watch out. Um, Chargers and Jets. Uh, oh, yeah. The Jets do have not not bad team because I watched them 
very closely. Was, I'm going to take Chargers and back to the uh, Broncos, or I'll take Redskins on that one. Jaguars for Niners, easy. Jaguars. They're so, so great. They're going to be amazing. And uh, Seahawks and Cowboys, oh my god. Anyone, anyone talking about Seahawks. What a destroyed game that was. Oh my god, that guy didn't bad. I knew it was going to be dangerous. Um, they just got pummeled there. Imagine that. Russell Wilson, seven sacks. He got down. Couldn't perform at all. Um, I'm taking Cowboys in that one. Giants and Cardinals take Cardinals. Just because I just don't really like the way Jarvis play right now. And then, so did that. We had the, yeah, we had two Saturday games in our Sunday games. And then Monday, Steelers and Texans. I'm taking Steelers. And then a nice one for me to watch right on Christmas night. Raiders and Eagles. I'm still taking the Raiders on that one. All right, I'll see you next week. And last week will be week 17. We'll be going playoffs. Thank you so much. And sorry about last time.